my country people. Now me again. Me and my friend Ebele won't plant rice on top of this farm. Rice na the most important crop for the whole world. Rice na the major food for more than 2.7 billion people for this world. And by 2025, now 4 billion people go need to the chop rice every day. Now why them they plant up to 4.5 million metric tons of rice every year? To plant rice, no be beans so. You go need to get the grains, come prepare the land, come plant the seeds, manage the water well well, manage the nutrients well well, kill all the nyama nyama pests before harvest time go come rich. You go dry the grains where you harvest, come store them before you go meal them. But to make sure say you get healthy rice with yakata harvest, make sure say you summer the crops with nitrogen with Indorama granular urea fertilizer. Rice, they grow well on top of the kind soil, way soft when you pour water on top of them, but they crack when you dry. To prepare the land before you transplant your rice, you go break break the ground well well, then you go full them with water, you go run your field two times with paddy poddler or one time with rotovator. Once you don't finish that one, you go plank the field, make everything they level. To submit the seeds where they good for planting, see what thing you go do. You go pour 1 kilogram of salt inside 10 liters of water for every 10 kilograms of seeds. You go to chuck 2 to 3 kilograms of the seed inside that salt water, make you see which seeds go they float and which ones go sink. You go come out the light seeds where they float and you go collect the ones where they heavy where they sink for planting. You go wash them 2 or 3 times with clean water before you treat them. To treat the seeds, you go put 10 grams of carbendazine or MEMC and 1 gram of streptocycline inside 10 liters of water for every 10 grams of seed. You go leave the seeds inside this mixture for 24 hours. After the time don't pass, you go come out the seeds from the mixture. Come cover them with baco bags where they wet small. You go to sprinkle water on top of the baco bags until the seeds germinate. To make sure say your rice grow well well with better nutrients, it they make sense make you use farmyard manure with chemical fertilizer. You go mix the farmyard manure at 2.5 tons per hectare inside the soil 25 to 30 days before you transplant. You go apply 100 to 150 kilograms of Indorama granular urea fertilizer for every hectare. That one have 5 to 7 bags of Indorama granular urea fertilizer. You go apply them in 3 parts. The first one now when you did transplant. The second one now after 21 days when the crops don't they grow well. The last one now after 42 days before the rice start to decompose. You go apply phosphorus at 60 kg per hectare, potassium at 60 kg per hectare, and zinc sulfate at 25 kg per hectare when you transplant. If you notice say your crops get zinc deficiency, you go spray them with 0.5% zinc sulfate and 2.5% Indorama granular urea. Now where you don't savvy how to summon nutrients for your crops, Make I tell you how you feel control weeds and pests. If you been do direct sowing on top of your land without transplanting, you go spray Alaclor 50 EC or Butaclor 50 EC at 4 liters per hectare before you plant your rice. Or you go spray Butaclor 50 EC or Thiobencarb 50 EC at 2 to 3 liters per hectare inside 700 to 800 liters of water 2 to 3 days after you don't plant your seeds to control any kind of weed wavy grow on top of your farm. If you been do transplanting, you go spray Anilophos 30 EC at 4 liters per hectare or Oxyflorphen at 200 grams per hectare or Butaclor 50 EC at 2 liters per hectare inside 600 to 700 liters of water 5 to 7 days after you don't plant your seeds to control any kind of weed if you grow on top of your farm. This is now what you go do for the nyama nyama pests if you chop your crops. To control stem borer and insects where they cut leaves, you go spray Fipronil 0.3 grams at 25 kg per hectare and Cartap 50 WP at 800 milliliters per hectare two times after 7 to 10 days. For the diseases, to treat blasts, you go treat your seeds with Agrosan GN or Serasan, Therium or Carbendazine at 2 grams per kilogram of seeds and you go spray 0.1% Hinosan 50EC Carbendazine or Tricyclazole at 500 grams per hectare. You go also add Hexaconazole 3% and Tricyclazole 22% once a week for 3 weeks. To control brown spots, you go treat your seeds with Therium or Carbendazine at 2 grams per kilogram of seeds. 
you go spray a defense force at 500 millimeters per hectare or man them at 1 kilogram per hectare. You go also add hexaconazole 5% at 750 ppm. Time go don't reach for yakata harvest. Won't you see say the rice don't mature and the plants don't turn yellow? You feel you seek who harvest the crop with hand or you feel use harvester. If you they harvest with hand, you will come tie the crops for small small bundles, come heat them on top surface where they hard to come out the rice grains. Then you go blow the chaff come out from the rice. If you want better harvest with big big healthy crops, use Indorama granular urea fertilizer. 